Okay, and I, in this video, I'm just going to go over um, the different icon meanings for the different programs that you're going to be using. And everything that you're going to be using is going to be right here on this little taskbar. Now, what we have here is your Internet Explorer. That's what you use to open your email or research or anything like that. Now, this one is your word processor. That's what you type your letters with. Now, this one right here is your folder. That's going to have your different files in it, um, like uh, your scanned items. So, I'll just go over that real quick. You'll open that folder. And it'll bring up this window here. That window there. And then, what you'll do is you'll go over here to the side. And it'll be anything that you scan. Like whenever you select the scan to email option, it'll be here in pictures. So, it'll also bring up the folder for the date of whatever you scan the item like today we scanned 12313 and there you can see the documents that we scanned I'll go ahead and delete those for you go ahead and delete okay so there's you deleted now back here this icon right here, as you know, is the power button. So that's what turns off your computer. So I'll just go ahead and click it. And I'll bring this up. And if you ever just want to like come back to your computer after a little while, you don't want to turn it off and wait for it you can click sleep and it'll just go into power saving mode as you can see it went off there but it's still on it's just conserving power mode so in order to get it to come back on whenever you come back to it you'll just move your mouse a little bit and it should come back on There it goes. And also, if that doesn't work, moving your mouse, just hit your enter key here. And that'll make it come back on. So, and then if you want to turn it off, you go to the power button. And it'll come up here in a minute. There it is. And you'll click shut down. And that'll shut it down for you. Okay, and that's, once again, that's the, uh, the programs, an overview of the programs that you'll be using most frequently.